Hi, I'm Ryan Sims. This song is called Black and Blue. You can find it everywhere digital music is sold. I can't take this messed up love Cause I done took way, way too much My heart is beating fast in my sweat beats on the floor Well, I can't take this anymore And these scars are the chapters of the foolish things I've done In my time I've collected quite a few and these bruises are just fading memories that I don't want But you left me black and blue You left me black and blue We could fix this thing right now we'll Get together, sort the whole thing out no when I know that our love could never last Because the higher that we climb The harder that we crashed In these scars are the chapters Of the foolish things I've done In my time I've collected quite a few In these bruises are just fading memories That I don't want But you left me black Well, these scars are the chapters of the foolish things I've done In my time I've collected quite a few In these bruises are just fading memories I don't want You left me black and blue You left me black, black and blue Let me black and blue Ooh. I was going to ask you a question, Brian. Uh, that song and the song, uh, the single, mm -hmm. uh, I mean, these are story songs. These are mm -hmm. songs that, are, that, that they have a lot of uh, personal experience behind them mm -hmm. and a lot of you know, your own personal experience. But the recording of the EP itself, yeah. Uh, you mentioned that you worked with a number of different musicians yeah. of various backgrounds that, um, very storied backgrounds, mm -hmm. you called them like a, kind of like a mix of your heroes. Yeah. Talk to us a little bit about those musicians and all the projects. Sure. I had Kenny Arnoff on drums, who was um, John Mellencamp's drummer, um, you know, most well known as John Mellencamp's drummer, but he's been with Fogarty and just everybody great. Um, I had Daryl Jones from the Rolling Stones on the bass. Um, I had Slim from Lady Antebellum on guitar. I had Kim Bullard on keyboard, who uh, is with uh, Elton John. Um, it's basically a super group. You know, if this band would have gotten together outside of my project, it would literally be a super group. And um, I'm just beyond blessed I got to record with these guys. And um, we, <laughs> the great thing was, we never told them a thing to do. We just sent them the tracks and let them be themselves. And that was the best idea we ever could have had because how am I going to tell these guys what to play? You know, and uh, yeah, I think if people listen to the EP, they'll hear some phenomenal performances. You know, so that's that's how it worked. The producer happened to have some buddies, <laughs> mm -hmm. and they all said they heard the music, and then they said yes. They didn't just say yes. They they all took a listen to the songs and said they wanted to be a part of it. So it was a real honor for sure. My side of the story. Get it now, please.